In this video, we are going to learn how to create this square shape spring design in Blender. So let's start. So let's hide this body. So first thing that I need is, is a cube. So let's do this G Z. So increase or decrease the cube size as per your requirement. Okay. In my case, I will increase its height. Scale along the z-axis. Let's say five times. Okay. So you can increase or decrease its heights or you know uh, length, length and width as per your requirement. So how should I approach to make a spring here? So what should I have to do is click on Add Curve, click on Curve Spirals, click on Archimedean. Just in case if all these options are not showing. What you have to do is click on edit preferences and search for extra and make sure that you select add extra curve objects okay remember the curve one not the mesh curve after that click on add mesh curve click on curve spiral click on archimedean you can see my default values are uh, already there in in your case it is not same so just match it up as per your requirement okay after that uh, I say my shape look like this let's increase this number to 40 okay now what I have to do is select this click on here click on shrink wrap and I will shrink wrap about this after that click on here click on apply let delete this cube select this one go here and increase this value go here and add subdivision surface so in that way you can make this shape you can also make triangle or any other shape as per your requirement uh, it is quite simple suppose someone say hey i want to make a you know spherical one uh, you can also make it uh, let's make the size big let's say for example 3 meter i'm just showing you a simple more, one more of example after that i will return just you know so that you can get idea increase the size and one thing that you have to make sure that the total height of the spiral should be less than must be less than uh, basically the top of it okay so i will decrease the number of turns uh, i think up to this height is fine now what I will do uh, before I do something else right click shade smooth and add a subdivision to the surface so when I will use this one shrink wrap I will get a better result and click on apply select this sphere click on X delete so in that way you can you know you can get more better shapes as per your requirement and it's up to you so I hope you learned something from this video. If you have any kind of doubts and queries, feel free to ask. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Namaste.